Yeah, wonderful people, you are welcome back again. We are still on BVI channel one where we tell you the unadulterated gospel's truth. Like I told you, I'll be responding to or reacting to one Reno or mockery that is only mocking himself, not the suffering Nigerians. He made a tweet, you know, his Twitter handle. He had posed himself as a media influencer. Pay the media influencer, which I'm going to expose before the end of this video. He had come to mock himself, not the suffering Nigerians, with his tweet. And the Nigerians have given it to him hot, hot. Now, I'm going to just highlight on just very few response they gave to Reno or Mokri. Like from Ayo Deji. Ayo Deji said that that's Ayo Deji or oh, Ya yeah, Wumi. You still don't get it. We voted for Adeleke, not PDP. And we are voting P2B in our soon, come 2023, not Labour Party. That is coming from a Nigerian in our soon state. Those that participated in that election now that adeleke has won let's be clear that we voted adeleke and not pdp party this come 2023 election please vote competence and not party be wise these are nigerians in also state responding to even atiku abubaka and pdp and the Reno or Mockery that is mocking himself, believing that the win they registered in Osun State is a win for PDP. No, it's a win for the people. Because it is the people that decided to vote the person. Now, it is a lesson to all political parties, including Labour, moving forward. Nigerians are changing the narrative. They are changing the game. If you decide to go and field the worst set of people whom Nigerians already have their track record, because we have all their records, if you like, field them as your candidate moving forward, you are going to fail woefully because people are not voting your political party. They are voting credible individuals. It's as simple as that. We started it in Anambra State. We pushed for a credible candidate. We campaigned. I personally, which every one of you acknowledged, for Soludo because he is more competent and more credible than other people that contested in that election. If Apoga had fielded another person, I can assure you that they will lose that election. So we have awoken the sensibility of the Nigerian people to understand that it is not just about the party, but about the individual. So it is a lesson to all these political parties doing buying and selling politics. If you like, go and bring out a goat. Go and bring out a corruption personified in human form as your candidate. You will fail woefully. That is the lesson. Both APC and PDP will learn come 2023 by fielding the worst set of people nigerians have their record it is as simple as that that is as simple as that so nigerians are beginning to realize it is not just about hey this one of unkani or the one that africa will normally say in carbon carbonkani no it is in candy politicians if you have the same crooks or corrupt politicians piloting the affairs of the people it is always their turn just like the jagaban of lagos said it is his turn at least he was sincere enough to say it is his own turn and not the turn of nigerians p2b is saying it is now the turn of nigerians and that is why nigerians are coming out in mass especially those of you that are political um uh, traders those who are already being bought and being paid placed on salary to sell nothing 
to Nigerians in the name of a candidate under PDP or APC. I want to remind you that Nigerians are wiser. Nigerians are what? They are wiser. They have known that it is not just about saying this is our party or this is your party or trying to 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 who quake to be and push him to become a regional party man all nigerians from the east west north and south are rooting in for the competency they see in the man Pito B. and we are going to serve apc and pdp their breakfast come 2023 because we are going to vote we are going to count the vote and we are going to defend it that is what i am bringing to you as a response Take this video to all Nigerians to understand the power of coming out to vote and massively defend their vote. Your vote count. Do not be deceived. The only people that will tell you your vote doesn't count are the same politicians and their paid agents. These are the people that will tell you your vote doesn't count because they don't want you to vote at all. So that they will use the already narrowed mindset of people they have been using to manipulate to win elections. Now we are changing the game for them. So tell them they should go and chill because Nigerians have woken up and they are going to take their lives back. You all know why I am pushing for the man Pitobi, for the liberation of all suffering Nigerians from the east, west, north, and south to set free all indigenous people trapped in nigeria under one unitary scam they called one nigeria that is the truth every nigerian is a victim and that is the truth many people will not tell you and i keep telling you that until nigeria is restructured back to regional government where every region will be able to be viable under credible individuals to run their affairs with all this divide and rule, these walls will be crumble, and the people will rise and take their lives back and use what God blessed them with to harness and improve their lives. The issue of insecurity will be a bygone. The issue of marginalization will be a bygone. Nobody will incite the north against the west or the east against the north or the north against the south or west. Because they hide under this very big enclave they call one Nigeria to manipulate and subjugate the people. The only beneficiaries of this system are the politicians. That is where I'm wrapping up. Keep watching, keep liking, keep sharing. Don't miss a thing. I thank you all for being very um, supportive and um, you exercise patient the two weeks we stayed on our suspension we are back and we are stronger i will start bringing it to you a very wonderful program where you can air your opinions and join in the conversation on a live program matters arising and people's parliament i'll be bringing it live for you as we are getting on this very era because we need everybody's voice to be part of this process i'm signing out i'm asking peter stay safe and all time don't forget to subscribe like and share drop your comments i want to have your opinion Stay safe.